My name is Ewan Dickinson and I'm a producer and engineer with Massive Attack here in Bristol. I became involved with Massive Attack when I was about 17 years old. I kind of got my foot in the door in their old studio when I was a, a T-boy and assistant for, for many years. Um, and uh, kind of over the years have had more experience and more opportunity to, uh, to get kind of more involved in the creative process. And, um, managed to learn and had great opportunities along the way and yeah, very, very lucky to do what I do and enjoy it very much. At the moment we are gearing up for rehearsals for a summer tour um, and you know, we had a, an EP come out earlier this year of new music and we toured in January and February. Um, we've had some kind of downtime since then, we're in May, um, where we've been kind of writing new material and recording and then we'll get back into kind of touring live show mode very shortly. Our studio has, has evolved over the years since we moved here in 2004. It was originally based around an SSL G-Series 56 channel console, which was a fantastic bit of equipment to learn on, but it quickly kind of slightly redundant in its use, um, becoming a fairly hefty volume control for Pro Tools. Um, so over the years we've kind of, we've, we sold that in the end and, and had a kind of interim desk um, whilst also always wanting to invest in, in something new that was going to be able to give us the best of an analog proper recording desk but also that was more tailored to kind of modern workflow and our needs. Um, so that's why we kind of went through the new Genesis, it seemed to tick all the boxes and, and allow us to do everything that we wanted to do um, and that's what our kind of studio is based around now and has been since we got it in 2012. The way we use Genesis is you know, in a pretty typical traditional mixing desk kind of way. We always have it hooked up to lots of drum machines, synths, and have it just as an input desk for when we're recording and jamming. Also, we use it with our live room to do live sessions, um, which is fantastic. We can split up mixes and, and be able to use it as a straight up mixing console. Um, and also, we rehearse for the Massive Attack live show here, so it kind of bass is, is the centre of, of rehearsals when we have two drummers, bass, guitars and you know and, and it performs to us really well. It sounded great, yeah, yeah, it's like I say, it's 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 a great mix of old and new and that you you, you can just use the desk without having to hook up the outboard and, and you get a great sound. The preamps are great, EQ and the dynamics are great. So it yeah, it, it works really well but it's also you know it we don't always have to to use it as a as a full-on mixing desk. Sometimes it is just, just stereo out of the, of, of, our, of the, the computer. But it, um, wherever we throw it, it always sounds great. I, I don't. I haven't really been too surprised about too many features of it. But it, it's just been really solid. Working with older desks and with crappy channels and dodgy pots, it's just been really really reliable. And everything that we've thrown at it and needed to do, it's just performed admirably. I, I like the, I mean, the instant recall feature of the EQ and the dynamics is, is great and it really doesn't take long to get the desk back into a state that it was previously. It's the fastest, you know, recall that, that I've ever been able to do which, with a desk which is this flexible. We have a, a summer tour this, this summer, obviously. We've got a big show here in Bristol which went on sale today and that's uh, sold out very quickly which is great news and we'll be using the Neve to, uh, to get the band in order and to, to get all the songs ready so we can put on a really good show this summer you know, wherever we are um, but I know it'll, it'll do the job so yeah, bring it on.